guys, it's Shadow the Rat, and in today's video, I want to introduce you to my two new babies. They are six weeks old, and I got them from a lady who had a oops litter in my area. Um, I think she adopted a pregnant rat from a pet store by accident because there were some missexing issues. Anyways, these two come from that litter, and they are very cute. The original reason I was going to get them was because I thought this little black self girl right here was a goody. She looked to be a goody in the pictures, but unfortunately it did not turn out to be the case. That being said, black self is one of the rat coats that I really wanted for a long time, so I'm still very happy of course. And I was initially only going to get her, but then my mom asked if we should get a second one because of their age. which. As some of you might know, it's best to always get younger rats in pairs, especially if your rats are not the same age or not similar in age to them. So this here is a uh, s'more. She is, I think, a Champagne self or a Champagne Berkshire. She has a white belly, I think. I'm not sure. You can't really see in this light, but you can tell she is a Champagne color. And of course, my other little girl is a black self, but she's mismarked because she has these two cute little splotches on her belly. They're white. So yeah, you can see her right here. They are kind of skittish, which I already knew going into them because the lady told me she didn't have very much time to spend with them. And because they came from an oops litter, you don't always have a guarantee personality wise. They are still very sweet. They don't bite or anything like that. And they are slowly coming around. As you can see, this is Biscuit here. She is actually my smallest uh, adult girl, so you can see kind of the size comparison. But anyways, as you can see, I have introduced them to my older rats, and they're all around. And they are all living in the big cage already because intros went super well. Um, funny enough, Cream actually decided that she's basically completely chill with them. She's even nicer to them than she was Marshmallow when doing intros, and she just sits there and lets them climb all over her. They basically curled up and fell asleep next to her in the hammock earlier. It was just super cute, and she was the rat I was worried about most. And the little babies have definitely gotten more confident since meeting my older girls. They were more skittish in the beginning, but now they'll take treats from me. They are okay with me filming them apparently, which is kind of cool because I haven't actually done this before, and this little girl has red eyes. But yeah, they are very cute and sweet. Oh, and I forgot to tell you the other girl's name. Her name is Mocha, the black self girl. And this girl here, like I said, is S'more. So yeah, very cute little babies. Expect to be seeing more of them. I'm thinking of doing some really cool videos on them because in this case, at least, they're kind of skittish. They aren't really used to handling or anything. And because of that, I can do some cool taming videos with them. I already do have a taming video that I like, but I thought I'd do some informal taming. And then I also know that I'm kind of late with my trick videos. Uh, those mostly stop because I've been having 10 to 12 hour days at school, so, well, at college, and those are pretty <laughs> crazy when you're trying to sleep and do other stuff too, so I wasn't having enough time to just put everything together, and so that kind of went to a halt. I will try to get out a few more of those, but I don't expect to get out as many as I wanted. Anyways, I thought with these girls I could do some informal training sessions. Basically, I can show you their first training session right off the bat, because as obviously you can see, they are a little skittish, they haven't started training at all. In fact, they're in the free range area, but they haven't explored anything but this little travel cage I have here, and that's just because they're still pretty nervous. Oops, sorry about that. But yeah, I expect them to start to come out of their shells, and I'm just going to keep working with them. And of course, once I start training them, I will be posting those sessions online. And I think those are going to be really helpful to people just starting to train their rats, especially if your rats are a little bit more skittish or timid. So yeah, these girls are very sweet and I can't wait to get to know them better. Sorry for the lack of footage. Like I said, they're still very skittish, so I can't really handle them or so forth. Oh, sorry, Biscuit. <laughs> Biscuit has a big piece of food in her mouth. Hey, Biscuit. I just woke poor Biscuit up. But you can see them in the background some. You will definitely see more of them in the future, so don't worry. This is kind of just a first looks video. So yeah, I will see you guys later, and I hope you are as excited as I am. Bye!